in the atomic size that we, I've been talking about, I, I, I clearly do this where the size increases as you go down the group and the size increases as you go from right back to left again across the period. I know that's kind of strange, but that's the way it is. And I kind of qualified it for the main group elements, main group elements. Um, otherwise known as all those main group elements, the groups start with group A. So those are group A elements. And what I didn't include in this trend is actually those group B elements or those transition elements. So this next slide kind of takes a look at um, this figure right here looks at those group B elements. Now you have to go the third column in, okay, and each of the bars then, the height of the bar is indication of how big the atom is. So starting right here, can you see that we have... Um, we have, uh, well, I don't have the element marked there, but this uh, this element that is in the same period as potassium, that is the uh, starts the transition elements. Notice that, and then this, if we go across the same period, for instance, zinc, and we go back to see if the size gets smaller, it does not entirely get smaller. But again, this doesn't count because it's the group B elements. I would say though we do have the trend down the group. Okay, we don't have the we don't have the trend across the period. I meant to say period. We don't have the trend across the period, but we do have the trend down the group.